Well, I won a dramatic game, but a tremendous morale-boosting victory. It was. After the first half, we were look, <coughs> looking at the result and we're thinking, uh, how are we getting beat at half-time? Because I thought first half we dominated the game. We lost two cheap goals. Um, and obviously we scored a really good goal. It's a great ball in for Jason Talbot. And Nicky Clark does what he does. And he gets there and finishes it off. So you say disappointing to, to lose two softish goals. You made the change at half time and it worked out well for you. No, I did. Uh, we've got a lot of quality in the bench, a lot, a lot of competition. Um, so it's good to see they come on and made an impact. And Lewis Martin acquitted himself well in the centre of the defence. You then had the bonus of Ryan Williamson as an attacking threat as well. I did. He was bombing up and down that. He was back to his, his best again. Um, but I thought it was a real team performance. We didn't deserve to get beat. Um, but how many times we said that this season, so it's good to finally get the win that the boys deserve, and I'm sure they'll take a lot of confidence from it. You brought in goal scorers into the squad, and after getting a bit of game time under their belt, both Nicky Clark and uh, significantly furried El Alagu at the end there, getting on the score sheet. Yeah, Nicky was sensational today, I thought. He was everywhere. <clears throat> he set the tone for the game, uh, closing people down. Obviously, his, his finishes were, were class, um, and he just brings a bit of quality to the team. Long way to go in the season, of course, but the way the results have worked out, you've jumped a few places in the division onwards and upwards. We did say it's, it's very early in the season. Um, I think we're in a false position. We should be a lot higher um, with the performances we've had this year. Um, but that will do a lot for confidence and hopefully now we can kick on. A way to one of the teams in a similar area of the league, Air United, Familiar with them from last season, won't be easy. They've signed some good players as well, guys like Harkins that have played at the, the highest level. So we know it's going to be a tough test, it's a hard place to go. Um, but after today's game, I'm sure the boys will be full of confidence and looking forward to it. And in this league, it's about consistency and putting a string of results together and working your way up the league. Slightly different today in front of the live TV audience. They certainly got value for money when they were watching. Are we ever going to get a boring 1 0 from you? <laughs> That, to be fair, the way we play, we try and attack and score goals, so um, obviously we need to tighten up defensively and we can't afford to lose, score four goals every time they want to win, um, but it was a lot of positives there.